before we begin our commencement ceremony, the senior class members request all cell phones be silenced and for all guests to remain seated until all class members' names have been called to receive their diplomas. The class of 2020 thanks you in advance for honoring this request. Good morning, fellow classmates, teachers, parents, and loved ones. Well, you guys, we did it. Even though many believed we wouldn't be able to, we finally made it to our graduation day. I know our senior year did not turn out the way any of us had pictures, to say the least. We did not get the traditional farewell, farewell <laughs> to our dear coffee high. Seasons were cut short, trips were canceled, and what seems like the whole end of our senior year simply swept under the rug. But that does not take away from any of the memories or accomplishments of the class of 2020. I'll be the first to say it. Our class has been through a lot in our three years at CHS. From starting out our sophomore year cheering on the Trojans in their first ever state championship football game, to finishing out high school going through a global pandemic, we definitely had many ups and downs. All of that is now in the past. We've survived more than any of us thought possible, and we've done nothing but grow from it. I have full faith in the things that our amazing class can and will accomplish in the years following high school. We will have teachers, doctors, lawyers, and who knows, we may have ourselves a couple of rocket scientists in our midst at class reunions. I'm beyond proud to say that I was a part of the class of 2020. We were the class that made history. We were the class that continued our education through one of the toughest times our generation has ever seen. Thank you. At this time, please stand for the presentation of the colors and remain standing for our national anthem. Thank you. You may be seated.
Caroline Smith, Rebecca Miranda, Jose Ornelas. Each one of these names brings back a memory in someone here today. Each one of these played an important part in our lives. Not only did they share our classes, they shared our dreams, they shared our joy, and they shared our heartache. Those of us who remain here today, continue to keep the memories of our classmates close at heart as we think of all the memories we shared. They say there is a reason, they say that time will heal, but neither time nor reason will change the way we feel. For no one knows the heartache that lies beneath our smiles. No one knows how many times we've broken down and cried. We want to tell you something so there won't be any doubt. You're so wonderful to think of, but so hard to be without. We cannot bring back the old days when we were all together, but the memories we made in school will live in our hearts forever. Poem by an unknown author. Class of 2020, I ask you today, as you move throughout your life, never forget the special bonds we share as a class. We've suffered so many heartaches throughout our life already that it has shaped us into the strong individuals we are today. Always dream big and shoot for the stars. Thank you. Good morning. I would like to start by saying thank you. Thank you to our administrators, teachers, coaches, friends, and family for gathering here today to celebrate the accomplishments of the class of 2020. Yes, we did make it, but let's be real. Our senior year has not gone as planned. I would dare say no one even dreamed this worldwide pandemic would have taken place. COVID-19 has stolen a lot from us. Our last honors night, our last spring sports seasons, our last prom, our last times walking the halls of Coffee High. But it has not stolen our future. I am extremely grateful for this time together and for all of those who made this graduation possible for us. And although this year has felt unfinished in many ways, we, the class of 2020, have made history. Today, we do close this chapter in our lives, but we also begin a new one. In a quote by a beloved teacher here at Coffee High, Mr. Colby Patton, in life, our greatness is not defined by our achievements. While those can be great, greatness is defined by overcoming obstacles and paving new paths. I believe that this is exactly what the class of 2020 has been doing and will continue to do. Proverbs 3, 5, and 6 says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him, and he will make your path straight. Yes, there is no doubt we are graduating in a time of uncertainty. But I know we are going to accomplish great things. My prayer for each and every one of you is that the Lord will guide and protect you as you chase and fulfill your dreams. Wishing you all the best, Class of 2020. So, here we are. I know this isn't quite what we imagined in our heads. Ever since we began high school, we fantasized about this moment. Standing together, throwing our caps in the air, finally graduating. Our last time together as a class. And, well, it might be 28 days later, but we're here. After nearly three months of uncertainty and exhaustion, we made it. And that says a lot about the class of 2020. I want to take this moment to say thanks, first, to our teachers, who continue to care even after school ended. To Ms. Vickers, Dr. Ragsdale, and Mr. Smith, you three have been consistent throughout my time in high school, and I cannot thank you enough for everything that you've done for me. Second, to our parents and families that offer their never-ending support and for truly believing in us. And last, to our friends, who stayed with us every step of the way, who we will always share these memories with. To anyone who has helped you get to where you are now, thank them. Their impact will go a long way. And, of course, take this moment to be proud of yourself. It wouldn't have been possible without the time, effort, sweat, and tears you poured these past four years. You have done tremendous things to be sitting here, graduating, 
Even though the circumstance is strange and unprecedented, you have every right to celebrate your accomplishments. And I have full confidence you will continue to do tremendous things throughout your life. Now, I'm not going to stand here and go on about how we persevered or reflect on the, all the memories we made or all the memories we could have made. You've already heard it all. Instead, I would like to share this quote President Barack Obama made during his recent commencement speech. With all the challenges this country faces right now, nobody can tell you, no, you're too young to understand, or this is how it's always been done. Because with so much uncertainty, with everything suddenly up for grabs, this is your generation's world to shape. Fellow classmates, this is our world to shape. And in order to make an impact, we must work to put others before us and to help others in times of need. For those people who do not have a voice, who are not heard in our society. The best way to create change is to influence others, build a community, and be involved in the decisions that impact lives daily. Empathy is necessary in order to build connections and relationships that lead to change. Though we might never understand what others are going through, we can do our best by listening and helping. I know we all desire to soar to new heights and climb the fable mountain of success. But we must realize our goal in life is not to work for ourselves, but to work for the welfare of others and the betterment of society as a whole. This is our world to shape. With all the injustices and challenges we face, we are the ones to lead and inspire change. That is why it's vital for us to continue to speak out, to break the silence, to show we're not afraid. Ever since March 13th, we've all constantly asked ourselves, why? Why us? I still haven't figured it out. But what I do know is that there is so much that needs to be done, and it all must start with us. We must call out the poor leadership and insufficient decision-making and use the experiences we've gained to ensure that future generations will not have to encounter the same obstacles. We must ensure that a repeat of 2020 never occurs again by taking action. And so, I am urging all of you right now, if you can, vote. I cannot stress enough how important it is for you to exercise your right and follow what you believe. Every vote matters. Use the privilege given to you for people who might not have it. Use your voice. Fellow classmates, this is our world to shape. And we are the ones to create history. Thank you. Staring out the window of their SUV Complaining and saying I can't wait to turn 18 She said I'll make my own money And I'll make my own rules Mama put the car in park out there in front of the school and She kissed her head And said I was just like you you're gonna miss it.
Principal Coffee High School, and on behalf of the staff, faculty, and class of 2020, welcome to our commencement ceremony. At this time, I'd like to recognize, recognize our board members: Ms. Reagan Miller, Ms. Tanya John, excuse me, Tanya Wilkerson, Mr. Adam Lott, Mr. Brian Preston, Mr. Jesse Giles, our superintendent, Dr. Morris Lees. Assistant Superintendent Kim Miller, Assistant Superintendent Dr. James Banks Jr., our elementary school principals, Ambrose Dr. Mary Vickers, Broxton Miss Allison Spate, Eastside Miss Amy Vining, Indian Creek Miss Tamara Morgan, Nichols Miss Lori Bratcher, Satella Mr. Lee Mobley, West Side, Ms. Wendy Jowers, West Green, Ms. Alan Chancy, Coffee Middle School Principal, Ms. Sherry Berry, George Washington Carver Freshman Campus, Ms. Dave Morris, Assistant Principal, Ms. Tammy Bennett, Principal of the Alternative Program, Ms. Tanya LaShore, Career Academy Principal, Ms. Pam Smith, Coffee High Administration, Ms. Angeline Calston, Ms. Rhonda Dorsey, Ms. Anastasia Carter, Dr. Lee Lang, Mr. Randy Garrett, Mr. Van Allen, and Ms. Millie Williams. At this time, Ms. Pam Smith, the Career Academy, will come up and share some words for the graduates. Good morning. 2020. Some call it the year of perfect vision. Others may remember it like a bad dream. One thing is for sure, it will be remembered. This year has been full of uncertainty and many times disappointment, but you persevered through it all to make it to this day. Don't let what has happened this year take away from your many accomplishments. The trials of 2020 taught us many lessons. Life is not always predictable. If plan A doesn't work, you will always need a plan B and often even a plan C. Things happen to make us slow down and take a look at what is most important to us. Never lose sight of that. You all have potential. No matter where you are sitting on this field, you have the ability to make a difference in the world. Go forward, living each day better than your last, and always, always know your worth. Thank you. Class of 2020, first of all, we must honor those who have made this day possible. Would our entire audience please stand? Would our entire audience on both sides please stand? Graduates, at this time, take make eye contact and point to your loved ones and those who are watching on live stream. Take a good look at these people. They have encouraged you, worried about you, provided for you pray for you, but most importantly, they love you. So realize that you're not getting to this day by yourself. Now let them know how much you appreciate all they have done and give them a hearty round of applause. Thank you very much. Audience may be seated. 
Education is a K-12 process. Now, with all my fellow colleagues of the Coffee County school system, no matter what role you play, please stand. All my colleagues in the Coffee County school system, please stand. Now, let me tell you something about this group of people. The month, these days and months since March 13th, I think a lot of people, the country, the nation, the world, understands how important these people are now. And I don't think anybody be more excited and happy when school starts in the fall than the parents. This group of people are very, a lot of times are not getting the recognition they deserve for their hard work and everything they do. Everyone along with me, please recognize all they can give them a hearty round of applause. Thank you very much. Now, let me share a little bit about this class. See before you is 426 graduates, 86 honor graduates. Some will enroll in a four-year college or university. Others will enroll in a two-year college or technical school. A select, a select number will honor the, them, themselves and their country and enter into the, a branch of the military services. The rest indicated they'll enter the workforce. All their athletic teams have advanced into the state playoffs. They've been recognized in band core competitions throughout the state. Graduates of the career and technical education programs have earned distinction at the regional, state, and national levels. This group of seniors has ha held their own in competitions against students from all over the country. The students you see sitting before you have held leadership positions at all levels. The class of 2020 has recipients of the Zell Miller Award scholarship. This scholarship is awarded to students that have at least a 3.7 grade point average and a score of at least 1,200 on the ACT, excuse me, uh, the ACT or 26 on the ACT. If class has advanced placement of scholars, these students have scored three or higher or three or more advanced placement exams. Overall, it's estimated this class has been awarded scholarships in excess of $1.7 million. They have given back their communities by accumulating countless hours of community service. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe in consistency, protocol, and routine. So I'd like to start this last day for you as a student at Coffee High School. as the way we start every morning. Again, after the Pledge of Allegiance, you'll hear, this, you'll hear these words. Good morning, Coffee High School. This is Roland Cummings, your principal, with this inspirational quote for today. Class of 2020, this morning, I'd like to share with you some final nuggets of inspiration. After thinking about what I can share is something that's profound, that would hopefully make an impact, and last but not least, brief. Three things have come to mind. Control the controllables, serve in leadership, and your dreams are in your imagination. When it comes to controllables, three things you can always control. Your attitude, your outlook, and your response. When it comes to attitude, there's two kinds of people. Those kind of people that when others, when you walk in the room, others smile. And there's another type of people, when you leave the room, the same people smile. What type of person are you going to, going to be? The person that invokes a warm feeling and makes people smile? Or the type of person when you leave the area, they smile? When you make the decision. Your attitude, outlook. Many times we cannot change what happens. The recent events of the past months, I understood, you know, it's a clear picture of that. But you always can control your outlook, how do you see things. You know, are you a half full or a half empty person? You know, some people have a solution for every problem. Some people have a problem for every solution. So make sure you decide which one you're going to be. And your response. The biggest attribute about response is the ability to listen. This is something I've had to learn myself and I still work very, very hard at it. Sometimes people listen to others just to, just to react to what they said and not respond to what they say. When you listen to someone, you're really taking in what they say and give you an opportunity to respond. So understand, don't just react, respond. It could be the situation, that could be your spouse, that could be your children, that could be your spouse or your children, your boss, whomever. Listen to respond and not react. Another thing I want to talk about is servant leadership. 
one of the speakers already talked about leadership. Leadership and serving leadership is putting your others, others before yourself. It is extremely important that we all look to serve. Dr. Martin Luther King said we all can be great because we all have the ability to serve. You do not have to understand Einstein's theory of relativity to serve. You do not have to have your subject agree with your verb to serve. The only thing you need to serve is a willing heart full of grace and a heart full of gratitude and love. And the last thing I want to talk about is your imagination is in your dreams. Your imagination or your dreams are in your imagination. Every one of you have dreams, but dreams are very, very, very delicate. You cannot share your dreams with everyone at the wrong or inappropriate time. Because some dreams are killed before they ever have a chance, they ever have a chance to grow. Give me a little story. When I was your age, I absolutely loved football. And I made no, you know, I made no apologies about that. Still do. And everybody that spends any time around me know I love the Florida Gators. I do not apologize for that. But when I was your age, I wanted to play college football. Now, there was nothing special about me as an athlete. If I was a member of the Trojans, I might have barely made the starting lineup. But my dream was to play college football. So when it came time to graduate, it wasn't mean much, it was much need for 170, 180 pound defensive lineman. So I entered into the military. Still had a dream, didn't share it with anyone. But at some point you got to put your dream into action and you have to activate your dream. And, and the peculiar thing about dreams is that dream is unique to you. That dream is not for someone else. Because if I'd have told some of my friends or even family that I wanted to play football at the University of Florida, they'd have thought I was crazy. And it's the same with you. You cannot release your dream to everyone. Your dream is unique to you. Some will never understand your dream. They will never. But the things you imagine are your dreams. And your dreams are in your imagination. So. Be careful who you share your dreams with. Fast forward, after four years in the military, I had an opportunity to uh, enter into a great university, and I decided I'm gonna give this football thing again a try. Did not tell anyone. So if you're not on scholarship at a major university, you're what's called a walk-on. That means you do not have athletic aid. The interesting thing, that same young man went from 175 pounds to 225 pounds in four years. Sometimes dreams need time to grow. But remember now, when that dream was just starting out, I did not release that dream to anyone. That was in my imagination. Some of your family members may doubt you. Sometimes you will doubt yourself. Just remember, your dreams are in your imagination. Don't release your dreams to everybody. Don't release your dreams to everybody. In the book of Timothy, it says, in terms of servant leadership, be a workman, study to show thyself approved, that you not be ashamed before him. In order to put dreams into motion, the first thing you have to do is wake up. Because a dream can become a nightmare if you don't put in the work. There's a lot of dreams, there's a lot of potential sitting out here right before me that will go unrealized if it's not put into execution. Class of 2020, you've endured un unspeakable things. But well, one of the things I do know about with the period of time we're going through, this is not the first time this happened in the history of the world. This is not even the first time this happened in this country. And hopefully we endeavor for it to never happen again, but we don't have a crystal ball and we cannot see around the corner. But I know the mind power and the willingness and the resolve in this class, you guys can accomplish anything you set your minds to. If 175 defensive of linemen, that was just a very average high school football player, could end up playing in a major, major division one university, you can do anything you set your mind to. 
I'm proud of you, you're a special class. Ms. Smith talked about 2020 being clarity. Hopefully your ideas are clear. Hopefully your ideas are clear. At this time, not the least, I certify that these graduates have met all the requirements set forth by the State Board of Education and the Coffee County Board of Education. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the class of 2020. By virtue of authority vested in me by the state of Georgia, the State Board of Education, the Coffee County Board of Education, and the recommendation of the administration of the Coffee County School System, I hereby certify that you have met all requirements necessary for a diploma and admit to you all of its rights, honors, privilege, and obligations. Congratulations, class of 2020. <laughs> Mr. Vickers, please call the graduates. Samina Musak Patel. Drew Kaushik Patel. Priya Rajendra Patel. Jonathan Alexander Maldonado. Anna Paulina Escobar Escobar. <laughs> Bennett James Bush. <laughs> Milka Odalis Ramirez. <laughs> Anna Grace Sultan. <laughs> Vicki Lynn Kirkland. Alex Chandler Johnson. Britt Cameron PV Jr. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Science and Business Administration. Eric Mason Pruitt. Kristen Elizabeth Rivers. Adriana Elaine Rivero. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Science and Allied Health with Honors. Ashley Victoria Goldberg. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Science in Middle Grades and Education with Honors. And an Associate of, an Associates of Arts and History with Honors. Silas Keith Childers. Samuel Seaborn Lastinger III. Abel Palomiki, Jonathan Caleb Fuller, Andrew Peyton Lee, <laughs> Kelly Anil Patel, Hannah Grace Hall, <laughs> Justin John Cosenza, Gregory Frank Lacoste, Tatiana Emily Gomez, graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Science and Allied Health with Honors. Zaria Erlene Potasia Ingram. Leanna Faith Atkinson, graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Arts and General Studies with Honors and an Associates of Science and Allied Health with Honors. Caitlin Michelle Hare. Abby Elizabeth Arnett. 
Madeline Michaela Booth. Tyler Scott Smith. Ruby Lane Griffin. Carlos Mauricio Lopez. Brock Allen Vickers. Adam Wesley Lott Jr. Zomi Elaine Tapia. Abra Brooke Adams. Callie Alyssa Williams. Cadence Lee Adams. Jonathan Lindsay Carver. Elizabeth Gonzalez Martinez. Destiny Jasmine Gomez. Ruth Ortiz. Tanner Michael Hampton. Brady Cole Dockery. Brooke Raylin Griffin. Bailey Anthony Weathers. Tania Lachey Johnson. Lindsay Rose Morris. Reagan Addison Smith. Alyssa Ray Sinclair. Katrina Jamicia Gaskin. Sarah Elizabeth Griffiths. Jason Lee Rich Jr. Caitlin Michelle Weatherington. Katie Beth Toth. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Arts in General Studies with Honors. Gregorio Laredo. Alec Brady Crosby. Ellie Nicole Perkins. Cameron Austin Levi Nettles. Ansley Grace Reed. Lily Jalisa Palmer. North Shalia Alicia Lemigan Carswell. Lindsay Brooke Perkins. Charles Cameron Lott. Lakia Jatavia Brockington. Hunter Jason Moore. Leah Kendall Gaines. Delilah Angelina Medina. Ryan Moreno. Aubriana Stephanie Taylor. Tamisha Lachey Napri Trotter. Cassidy Marie Hicks. Madison N. Martinez. Shelby Deanna Smith. Taylor Elise Whitley. Jacqueline Torres. Takara Lachelle Coley. Raylan Madison White. Jose Antonio Rivas Jimenez. Zachary Siler Welch. Timothy Jerome Tucker Jr. Addison Ashley Cole. Aurora Martinez. 
Lakeland Lott Abels. Connor Alexander Adams. Jesse Allen Adams. Caitlin Elise Adams. Keegan Mark Adams. Kinsey D. Adams. Connor Sharp Aguilar. Heber Eduardo Aguilar Ortiz. Nakaya Nicole Alexander. Norelli Selena Ambrosio. Armani Aliyah Anderson. Armori Ali Anderson. Gabriel Axel Ezekiel Arnold. Isaiah Artiga. Cameron Joseph Arvidson. Andy Gonzalez Arzait. Jaikiria Chandrane Aits. Sergio Otis Andrew Avalos. Valeria Linda Ayala. Imari Menaja Bailey. Zykevius Radarian Bailey. Nathan James Baker. John Guthrie Barrett. Seth Garrett Beasley. Alexia Monet Belcher. Janaya Nicole Bellamy. Richard Morris Bennett III. JC Ray Carolina Beal. Elijah Janaya Blackshear. Elias Bonilla. Kiana Kishe Bonner. Goshanti Aliyah Bruton. Selena Andrea Brigman. Clinicia Lachey Brockington. Zion Hezekiah Brockington. Aliyah Tayana Brown. Brandon Eugene Brown. Joe Preston Birch graduated from SGSC with an Associate's of Arts in Political Science. Bailey Elizabeth Birkin. Blake Michael Birkin. Miguel Angel Bustos. Sopak Sophia Carr. Emma Sue Carter. Tyrone Barry Carter. Abigail Rose Carver. Richard Blake Carver. Ashley Michelle Castaneda. Jasmine Castro. Sakaya Jafon Chambers. Nishana Nicole Chandel. Austin Ryan Cheney. Levi Shane Cheney. Ashley Lynn Clement. Kenny Tony Clemens Jr. Ariana Anise Coates. Ariana Marie Collier. Coriante Nicole Colson. Angelica Marie Contreras. Carrie Lynn. I'm oh, sorry. 
Uh, Angelic, uh, so sorry, Catalina Esperanza Coronado. Carrie Lynn Cawther. Jacob Tyler Corson. Lacey Brienne Corson. Carson Hope Cruz. Harley David Cruz. Jordan Taylor Cruz. Naisha Eliana Cruz. Kiera Chantel Currenton. Catherine Louise Daniels. Tyriana Chantez Daniels. Ty Excuse me. LaShawn Maurice Dantzler. Emily Lauren Davis. Jamaria Ariana Davis. Antonio Tyree Dawson. Rigoberto De La Cruz Jr. Zatabiana Arcaria Dennis. Destiny Jane Durham. Isabella DeMargine Epting. Antonia Espinoza. Mallory Danielle Fan. Leonardo Jose Farias. Christian Miguel Figueroa. Kaylee Ann Finch. Zadriana Zaine Flagg. Jaylene Rashawn Fletcher. Vanessa Jeanette Flores. Maria Azucena Frias. Joshua Gillespie Fulmore. Kalia Tajay Fulmore. Allison Marie Fussell. Dijon Riviera Fussell. Leonardo Galarza. Alberto Curtis Garcia. Alexis Garcia. Ashley Garcia. Efrain Garcia. Esteban Emmanuel Garcia. Giselle Garcia. Tanya Garcia Castillo. Layla Marshana Naquisha Gifford. Kaylee Ann Gillier. Ashanti Kiara Glover. Octavio Gomez Jr. Jasmine Diana Goodman. Ashlyn Taylor Gray. Jaden Faith Guthrie. Micah Darian Hancock. Kerrigan Nicole Harper. Eldridge Mason Harper. Hannah Rosalie LaRue Harper. Kaylee Brooklyn Harper. Laney Reese Harper. Brian Colin Harold. Kiesia Diagene Harold. Sherelle Nicole Harris. Aaron Willie Hartley Jr. Daquisha Sierra Harvey. Damaris Hernandez. Luis David Hernandez. Osvaldo Hernandez. Dustin Jake Heron. John William Herring Jr. Rachel Elizabeth Hill. 
Nigeria, Tyrone Holland. Bradley, Jordan Hollinger. Enrique, Blake Howell. Bren, Josiah Hewlett. Hannah, Michelle Hewlett. Cayman, Ryan Percy. Carter, Adam Hutchison. Talmadge, Ryan Hutto. Jalen, Runar James. Marzavius, Tamar Jenkins. Aquila, Shaikiasia, Alante Johnson. Janiria, Janiel Johnson. Lagan, Sierra Johnson. Cade, Evans, Jones. Omar, Dwayne Jones. Julia, Lene, Jordan. Lily, Madison, Joyce. Ezekiel, Dennis, Jess, Keenum. Garrett, McCade, Kelly. Brandon, Austin, Kite. Josiah, Wendell, Killebrew. Hunter, Dixon, Kimbrough. Hunter, Jacob, King. Jayla, Anahi, Lada. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Science in Business Administration. Joshua, Devin, Lassiter. Ethan, Mitchell, Lee. Ronald, Jerquavius, Lee. Nyla, Adesha, Leggett. Alicia, Samaya, Lewis. Ansley, Marie, Long. Jason, Colin, Lott. Maggie, Ann, Luke. Brandon, Ethan, Mai. Audrey, Michaela, Mansell. Graduated from SGSC with an Associates of Arts and Psychology. And Quenisha, Nikeria, Janae, Manley. Makaria, Elise, Manley. Bailey, Ann Martin. Samantha, Hope Martin. Moro, Eduardo Rodriguez Martinez. Ramon Martinez. Deani, Michelle Martinez Gonzalez. Matthew, David Martini. Shakaja, Deshaun Matthews. Mayana, Amari McAllister. Lucas, Killian, McCarty. Kanaya, Michelle McDuffie. Nicholas, Alexander, McDuffie. Jeffrey, Marquise, Orlando, McGinty. Hunter, Hawk McKinnon. Jonathan, Franklin McMichael. Azaria, Cedriana, Dejon McCray. Nakaya, Tiagene McCray. Edward, Melendez. Litsi, Guadalupe Mendez. Jasmine Araceli Mendoza. Noah Michael Mercer. Christopher Colton Merritt. David Michael Merritt Jr. Princess Randasia Merritt. Kaylee May Metz. Madison Grace Miller. Philip Connor Mills. Skyler Mackenzie Mills. 
Alicia Leanne Casey Mobley. Shania Gabrielle Mobley. Francisco Modesto. Kimberly Molina Perez. Ivory Octavia Nicole Moore. Jordan Bryce Moore. Ricardo Morales. Abby Ray Morell. Autumn Marie Morris. Kagan Wayne Morris. Tristan Nicole Morris. Tamaja Imani Norris. Ziblali Guadalupe Olmos. Dakota Clotine Osteen. Louisa Alexandra Ovalle. Candice Irene Pace. Daisy Pacheco. Jaquan Quavion Palmer. Jamal Dashad Paul. Marshanti Narissa Paul. Shelton Marshall Paul. Dominica Aguillon Perez. Denton Lee Phillips. Michael Andrew Pittman Jr. Summer Alexandria Porter. Terrence Ahmad Powell. Jesse Preston Reagan. Jonathan Ramirez. Asia Simonica Reed. The Quavius LaShawn Reeves. Jacqueline Patricia Rel excuse me. Jacqueline Patricia Reed. Cameron Walker Relaford. Bertine Reyes. Jordan Elizabeth Rice. Maria Shantiana Monier Riles. Sierra Nicole Riley. Raymond Holden Rinker. Janet Aran Rodriguez. Nadeja Ali Rodriguez. Jose Luis Romero. Bailey Joshua Russ. Israel Fabian Saavedra Gomez. Hadrian Rodolfo Sanchez. Michael Vladimir Sanchez. Rosa Hanai Sanchez Marin. Ludwig William Sanchez Tello. Abel Lawson Sanders. Christian Santos. Shalanda Victoria Scott. Andrew Cornelius Sears. Katarina Victoria Serrano. Ethan Andrew Sherrod. Jade Danielle Shoemate. Akiria Troyel Simone Simpson. I'm sorry, Simpkins. Austin Jarrell Simpson. Aaron Matthew Smith. Garrett Zachary Smith. Catlin Warren Smith. Joseph Harvey Smith. Justin Douglas Smith. Shailen Bree Smith. Caleb Andrew Snipes. 
Lexi Jane Lynn Sutherland. Kevin Thomas Spell. Caitlin Grace Spivey. Katie Maria Spivey. Timothy Ty Shannon Spivey. Tacavius Deshaun Stafford. Dalton Edward Stevens. Chisholm Quaig Stepto. Anthony John Leonard Stewart. Hunter Aaron Stewart. Kristen Lee Stewart. Kibiana Michelle Sudstill. Isaac Maurice Stiles. Isaiah Marquis Stiles. Jessica Via Gomez Suarez. Jalen Marquis Suggs. Jay Kelson Sutton. Kintiara Ajane Swinson. I beg your pardon. Kintiara Ajiana Swinson. Kelsey Marie Tack. Hollis Brock Tanner. Kelby Grace Tanner. Lauren Rose Tanner. Faith Mackenzie Tarrant. Trace Larrett Tatum. Charles Luke Taylor. Dominique Shamaria Taylor. Dominique Shamir Taylor. Maria Melissa Tercero Ramos. Morgan Sally Elizabeth Teston. Kristen Elsa Thomason. Jesse Christine Thompson. Felix Adrian Tinajero. Zanaya Nakiria Elaine Tobler. Caitlin Emily Toledo. Cameron Deshaun Tomblin. Savannah Dorothy Tompkins. Guadalupe Torres. Jose Julian Tova. Justin Dionysus Townsend. Seviante Torek Trailer. Sorry. Kristen Dakota Troop. Kyla McKenzie Tucker. Natalie Christian Valdez Maddox. Salvador Omar Vargas. Jessica McKenzie Vega. Jay Elaine Villa. William Keja Vickers. Jessica Renee Voorhees. Marcia Ruby Vowell. Oceana Nicole Walker. Chase Douglas Westbury. Amber Nicole White. Tashawn Tyree White. Tashina Shawnice White. Daniel Bryce Whitley. Michael Ashton Whitley. Journey Ajane Wilkerson. Ahmad Jordan Williams. Malachi Stefan Williams. Nikosha Miata Delicious Williams. Teriaka Chardé Williams. Travis Tyquavius Duval Williams. Zachary Hayward Williams. Christopher Maurice Wilson. Daniela Tamara Wilson. Justin Blair Wilson. 
Tayon Reese Wimberly. Alexis Michelle Windham. Abigail Yvonne Wolfert. Tanaya Lameki Zaire Woodbury. Andrew Camille Wright Jr. Hayden Casey Wright. Jodor Cedric Jaquan Wright. Titeriana Bernasia Samaya Wright. Latoric Cheon Wright Wynn Jr. Zulma Zapeta. As the graduates are making their way to the seats, we're going to dismiss the graduates first in a few minutes. And we're going to ask the audience to remain until all the graduates are off the field. Graduates, you've been instructed where to pick up your diplomas and other records. And so we want to move there as quickly as you can. You're going to have approximately one hour from the last time, the uh, last person that uh, walks through the gates. So we just want to give these graduates that's just uh, coming down the sideline an opportunity to get to their seats. We've been a great audience. Students, you've been great. You've done a tremendous job. You've done everything we've asked you to do. Audience, we thank you for your patience, your cooperation, and your understanding, and all the measures that we've taken to maintain everyone's safety. Thank you so much for honoring these graduates today. And I want to also impress upon the graduates and all your celebrations today to please be safe. Please be safe. So at this time, when the music starts to play those last two rows, just like we uh, practiced, we can go ahead and start the music and start dismissing the uh, grand off the field at this time. Thank you. I'm sorry, sir. How do Oh, I 